You hear about the bases? Come on. Okay, so check this out. We've got all of these bases here. I think we've got six, seven, I think we've got eight jazz bases ranging from, well, you know, uber awesome, like 60s jazz bases, all the way down to jazz, a jazz base that you could get for sort of like five, $600. To be honest with you, I kind of know that we've got some 60s jazz bases in here and we've got some cheaper ones as well and everything in between, but I've kind of forgot what we've got because I bought them, I don't know, maybe like four or five weeks ago. In fact, one of them is right here because I suppose it is an unboxing video, but I got this one out when it came. I couldn't help myself. It's just like, look at the, look at the top on that. It's just absolutely killer. It's a Sadowski. Um, New York, made in New York by Roger's team. It's just like absolutely phenomenal. I'll play this in a bit as well so you can hear it. But after we've unboxed all of these, and in fact, while I'm doing this, I'm going to tell you why I've got all of these bases and what we're going to do with them. But first, I need a knife. <laughs> At the beginning of 2020, we did a huge campaign called Win a Base, Build a School, where we partnered with uh, Pencils of Promise, which are a really fantastic charity that builds schools out in developing countries, okay? So we partnered with them. We did a huge base giveaway to raise a bunch of money. And, and we thought, well, 2021, we're going to do it again. But this time we're going to do it even bigger. We've got more bases. I think last year we raised $27,000. This year we're going to try and beat that with these bad boys. How do I get in these things? Uh. Oh, so Ooh. okay. So this is a five string sire base. <laughs> Okay, so this is wicked, this one. Check it out. So this is an Atelier Z. Super heavy. Wow, it's like an old school, like the, the Marcus Miller trying to cop that same sound. Wow. Okay, so this is the... 1969 with the matching headstock, which I absolutely love. Right, what else have we got? Okay, let me just move some of this out of the way. Okay, so next one, and again, I've got no idea which bases are in which. Ooh. This is, I found this online, and it's a, an early 90s um, Japanese um, jazz bass, and if you know anything about the early Japanese jazz basses, they're really, really sought after, so it's, it's killer. Oh, look at that. So, it's got that, definitely that, you know, that mild delight smell to it. So I've just realized that this might be, maybe this is the 66 and this is the 60. Let me just grab this one. So I'm gonna, I'll do a little bit of research in a minute to find out, but one of these is a 66, one of these is a 69. Ah, oh, they both feel great. My guess is, I think that this is the 66. I think this is the 60. I'll get back to you on that one. Okay, two more to go. What's 
this one? This is a four string Sadowski. Okay, this is again, this is um, the USA line. It was built over in Roger's workshop. And, um, and the reason why I got a four string is because we've got a five string Sadowski right here. Got the five string Sadowski, American Sadowski. I thought I'd better get a four string one as well. Um, just, to, just to even it up, you know. But it's absolutely beautiful. It's one of their satin models with gold strings, weirdly. Gold flat wounds. I think that this is a Fender Ultra. I think. Okay. Wow, that case is wicked. It is the... Fender Ultra, American Ultra, really nice actually. So we've got the original 1966 jazz bass. We've got an original 1969 jazz bass. We've got this amazing American made, beautiful blue Sadowski that I'm gonna cry when I have to send it to one of you guys. And we've got this beautiful sunburst American made Sadowski as well. We've got this amazing Atelier Z JB4. We've got this American made Fender Jazz Ultra. We've got this early 90s CIJ jazz bass. And finally, we've got this beautiful five string Sire jazz bass. <laughs> So even though this competition is, well, it's all about winning these awesome bases that you've seen today, and hopefully you will enter because it is completely free to enter. I'll make sure that there's a link down in the description below this video or somewhere around this video. So click the link if you want to join in this free giveaway. But remember, it's also about supporting Pencils of Promise, who we are partnering with for this giveaway. Last year, we raised over $27,000. And this year we're hoping to raise more than that. So we're shooting, we're shooting high, but hopefully these bases will help us do that. The full details of this giveaway and how to enter are on, all you need to do is click the link, it'll take you through to the page and you'll get all of the details there. So with that said, what are you waiting for? Click the link, get in this free competition and hopefully I will be sending you one of these amazing bases. Now, take it easy and I'll see you in the shed.